Hello everybody, and welcome to Ancient Architects. Please subscribe now to get the latest ancient history news and independent research from around the world. Peruvian archaeologists have discovered what they are calling an ancient temple that was once used in rituals of water worship. The temple is surrounded by 21 tombs that date between 1500 BC and 292 AD, but they were later reused, whilst the temple itself is thought to date back to around 1000 BC. The monument is 131 feet long and features an amazing 49 foot long central staircase. And experts think the site was used by a water cult for fertility rituals, but of course this is open to debate. It is located in the springs of the Zana Valley River as part of the Huaca El Toro site in the Lambayeg region of Peru, which is about 500 miles away from the modern capital of Lima. It was actually discovered back in October, but because of problems of looting, the discovery has been kept under wraps. The team of archaeologists is led by Dr. Walter Alva, and what they have discovered is the only example of megalithic architecture in Lambayeg. Inside the ruins there is a square with an altar, which the experts believe was used for offerings. There are numerous large megalithic blocks of stone that make up what would have once been spectacular looking walls, as well as a circular column where evidence of sedimentation of rains and rituals were found. Most of the tombs around the temple were reused by the Inca Chimu culture, which dates back to between 1000 and 1470 AD. As well as human remains, these tombs contain metal objects like knives as well as pottery. Because of the attributes of certain ancient gods, as well as features at many other sites across Peru, it is strongly believed that water was considered to be divine by the people, and was used in a number of rituals and religious practices. Experts say that this temple was the home of a cult that worshipped water, by studying the way the altar is positioned and also how it looks. This altar contains a number of holes, similar to those found in other temples from the same period of time, and are apparently typical of water altars in the region. As stated, the temple is located in the springs of the Zana Valley River, so maybe a spring was once located in the heart of this megalithic structure. The temple is also facing a specific sacred mountain, which contains evidence of ceremonial burning, meaning we are probably looking at some kind of sacred landscape. So, we have another large megalithic structure that may have been built over a spring or source of water. A structure that was clearly strongly associated with water. This reminds me of some other structures on the other side of the Atlantic Ocean. Ancient megalithic structures and water. What's the connection? Thank you very much for watching this news update from Ancient Architects. If you enjoyed the video, please subscribe to the channel, please like the video, and please leave a comment below. Thank you very much.